Well, President Trump railing against the Mueller probe, calling it a disgrace to our nation. Meanwhile, the man who appointed the special counsel, Rod Rosenstein, has yet to testify, even though he suggested recording his conversations with the president. So will the deputy attorney general ever go before Congress? Here to weigh in is President of Judicial Watch, Tom Fitton. Tom, thank you very much for joining us this morning. Good morning, Heather. So Good to be let's with get you. right to this. Uh, Rod Rosenstein, what is going on with him and why hasn't anything happened? Well, I think uh, the president is probably satisfied that uh, Mr. Whitaker is acting attorney general and Rosenstein's out of the picture in terms of supervising, uh, at least on paper, uh, the Mueller investigation. Uh, you know, Congress uh, failed in its oversight of Rod Rosenstein, has failed in its oversight of the Justice Department. The Justice Department has refused uh, to cooperate, and the Congress hasn't pushed back appropriately. So uh, he got away without testifying to date. And, you know, once the Republicans lose control of the House, they're not going to be positioned to force uh, DOJ's hand here. And the Democrats aren't going to be interested in asking Rod Rosenstein why he was conspiring against the president of the United States in a way they would overthrow him. So do you expect at this point they delayed it long enough to where it won't happen? Yeah, I suspect Rod Rosenstein won't be testifying to Congress anytime soon about his uh, jokes about wiretapping the president mm -hmm. and invoking the 25th Amendment.